Good morning, welcome to a turn two on Thursday the 4th of September. This is Kim Watson speaking for Easy Trader. Okay, looking at the Euro dollar first and quite a key day today. We've got the uh, ECB uh, interest rate meeting today. Now, last week uh, there was uh, lots of comments in terms of it, it may be just left alone for a further week, a further month rower. And we saw quite some sell-offs during the week, particularly on Friday. Uh, since then, um, there's this further pressures to uh, and figures that have come out which may put further pressure on the uh, team to uh, 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 carry on with some further softening. On that basis uh, it will be interesting to see what happens at 12.45 today um, listen to uh, Draghi's speech at 1.30 may get quite a lot of volatility later. Uh, the pattern has been quite a um, bit more volatility. I'll show you quite a bit more volatility in the earlier morning sessions, uh, and then consolidating each afternoon. And we're seeing much the same at the moment. It has just pushed up higher and broken through a, a short-term trend line. May run up to that four hourly uh, two hundred uh, before. Uh, sorry, hourly two hundred beforehand, uh, four hundred fifty. Um, Say so looking looking uh, in the short term relatively bullish, but uh, the the news will be the, the key deciding factor here. Uh, with a pound dollar, um, we put in a, a, a doji or um, um, spinning top candle yesterday um, from yesterday's chart. Cable still looks very weak in a sense, particularly with the uh, referendum uh, being discussed more and more and there seems to be more pressure on uh, the pound from the, the fact that uh, there's, there's talk if it was a yes vote, uh, the pound could, uh, it could be a run on banks. I think that may be um, uh, overdoing things, but uh, uh, e either way, if that's uh, people's perceptions, then we could see downside, um, and it may be easier for, for the pound to continue running downwards. Now we do have a little upside target, which is just about here, almost. It's air kissed earlier on at 164.46. Uh, it's 164.65 even. Oh, six, uh, sorry, 164.64. Um, um, around about that sort of area. Uh, aside of that, we've got the 50 above us, but uh, if it carries on running down well, yesterday's lows and maybe even some fresh lows may be made. Okay, that's it for me. Have a great day. Bye for now.